guys, it's me, uh, Crescent Wolf. I just sort of skipped over a spot kind of by accident. Uh, but it was mostly just talking stuff. Nothing really important. I just sold some of the stuff, and right now I'm shopping right now for spells and other possible things. And I honestly, I just want to get Ray Zombie. That one's really useful. Frostbite. And. Oh, I only have 47 gold left now, so. Yeah, you can get soul gems from this guy. This guy has some pretty good stuff. So yeah, I only have five gold left now, so I could sell the wolf pelt and the iron ingot if I want to. I mean, I'm not going to use some of this stuff anyways, like lanterns. I'm going to keep lockpicks because I always find a use for them, and charcoal. And I'm going to buy some more lockpicks, but I'm going to sell these books. And that one, I'm not gonna read it. Fair claws. I don't use ingredients because I don't make potions. Because I always find potions in other places. Always use food and potions. I mean, there's not really any time I don't need to buy any stuff. Most of the stuff you can get from other places. However, you can get in trouble real quick too if you're not careful so gotta be careful with what you do um, yeah so I just bought out this guy of lock picks and stuff and that's it gonna go out and go adventuring Blue Falls Barrow. You can see it from here, though. The mountain just over the building. Ah, okay. Uh, I'm gonna activate these two and activate this one. You'll find out why in a moment. Those trees must be mad hiding out there. There's a crypt that builds with nothing but glass trolls and who knows what else. <laughs> True. I wonder why they only sell Lucan's golden claw. I mean, we have plenty of things in the shop that are worth just as much coin. Lucan found the claw about a year after he opened the store. He never quite explained where he got it. He just took me once. Mm hmm. Bridge out of town. The path up the mountain to the northwest leads to Blue Falls Barrow. Okay. I guess I should get back to my brother. He'll throw a fit if I take too long. He's such a child. Later, lady. Um, you're not going anywhere. Oh, am I supposed to ask you something? Mara bless you for agreeing to help us. So, how much further? Well, it's a winding road up the mountain just ahead. You'll know you're in the right place once you spot the old watchtower. Once you get to the tower, head north. Bleak Falls Barrow should be just around the corner from the rock. Okay. Good luck. For a little minute, I will be waiting for you back in the shop. Alright, later. And. Because technically I'm not really wearing any armor. I don't know why I have this key. Um, 
just checking stuff right now. So I have 30 lock picks. I'll get a lot more later on as I'm running around. So yeah. So Bleak Paul's barrel should be this way, I think. Yeah. Da -da 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 -da. Ooh, pretty bugs. Butterfly, glowy bug. Oh, oh, this way. Right. Oh, hey, buddy! Oh, I kicked the. Oh, poor dog. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Okay. Increase my magic. Yes, please. And yes. Oh, I got myself a doggy. <laughs> Not a doggy, a wolf. What am I talking? And he's even following me. That's that's really cute. So yeah, off to adventure. <laughs> First quest already. That's really cool. Zombie dog. Well, not dog, wolf. But yeah, you get the point. There's a tower, just like the lady said. I'm guessing these guys are bad guys. Up, oh, up, oh, person, person. Hey, lucky person. Guess what? Ow! Hey, where are you? Lady, stop. Buddy! Hey, hey, hey! I'll take your stuff. Yeah, you got some good armor there. Uh, steel sword, yes. I'll throw the um, fur armor in your inventory. Don't need that. Equip, equip, equip. I'll keep that in there. I could equip shield and use that, but I'm not a really sh big fan of using shields. But yeah, so I'm gonna stick some of my stuff in this tower for now. Hey, more gold. I could sell these stuff in here right now if I want to. Uh, back at the shop. But no thanks. Oh, I think my dog died. My wolf. But, uh, oh well, I feel bad for it now. Okay. Yes, chest. Chest, chest. And some gold. Um, let's stick that there, there. Stick you in there, there, there. I'll equip you. Wait, let me take the shield back out. And weapons. Put that. Oh, I put the regular swords 
the iron swords back in the chest and there we go managing your equipment big important part of this game if you don't know what you're gonna do you might run into trouble real quick um, ah barrels <gasps> yes food thank you yeah that's there well i never noticed that barrel or that one so yeah, four barrels and tankards. Tankards. I could take that lantern, but I ain't gonna use it. Let them sell it. I mean, you could get some coin off of it. Not much, though. Let me just take a seat. Chillax. Take a breather. Eventually it'll turn daylight again anyways. Alright, wrong button. Ah, the buttons! I'm getting confused. Already. So yeah, me just saying dark, he can't see anything. La ha ha. Okay, time to get up. Uh, it's good to be up in the morning. This way, I think. Yep, this way. There we go. I discovered a place. A placey place. <laughs> At least I wasn't going. Where is the blacksmith? Where is the blacksmith? Markiplier. Eh. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, hello? Oh, hey, buddy! Oh! Oh, you got a axe thing! Oh, that's a hammer. I think that's a hammer. Yes, steel ore hammer. Where are you? Cooked beef. That's hard to come by. Why not? Why not take a knife? Oh wait, there should be more people. There should be one more person, I think. Oh, hey, hey, I see you, you naughty person. perfect timing instant kill I never done that and I never used a war axe before um, oh my that was scary but um, yeah that's the end of this episode <laughs> first time using a war axe and an instant kill on the second guy that is really cool okay um, Later for the next episode.